Did you know that your ability to get up and down from the ground can be reflective of your overall life expectancy? Today we're going to go over some movements that you can do on your own to both move and live better. I'm Michael Haber. I'm both a physical therapist and a strength and conditioning coach here at Elite Physical Therapy. I have a passion for just helping people move and live better. So today we're going to go over some tips uh, on movements that you can practice on your own to help with that. Okay, so the next tip we're going to cover today is just your ability to breathe. It seems simple enough, but what we often find in physical therapy is that we kind of lose the ability to breathe naturally. So what we tend to see in therapy, when patients come in or even when clients are coming in working on strength and conditioning, they tend to breathe more with their chest and their neck muscles. And the reason that matters, if we're taking thousands of breaths a day, we start tensing up our neck muscles, our neck starts to hurt, and we're just not getting enough oxygen in so we can perform well. So a quick test you can do on your own, either standing or lying down, is placing one hand up on your sternum, one hand on your abdomen, and as you breathe in through the nose, and out through the mouth, you should primarily see the movement coming from the abdomen, not so much up here. If all you get is breathing up here, take some time and really focus on this several times a day. Morning, lunch, and dinner, go through about 10 breaths. See if you can concentrate on breathing from down below. So I hope the tips you learned today were helpful to you. Uh, I hope they help you move and live better. If you'd like to learn more about you or your individual needs, or you would like your own free copy of uh, my guide to natural movement, go ahead and email me at michael at eliteptkc.com. Or if you'd like to schedule a free 30-minute consultation with me, go ahead and contact our office at 816 941-2550.